Welcome back to another Dancing on Ice vlog where myself and Olivia Smart attempt to be somewhat decent at figure skating and ice dance. <laughs> I just want to thank everyone's support so far in the competition. Enjoy the vlog. What was that? Would you ever start OnlyFans like Jack Laffer? Um, no. You should ask me that question. Would you? It's been thought about. Was it actually? <laughs> Do you know how much money they make? 100 grand a month. Yeah. Would, you? would you get your Falula out? No. I've got some nice looking feet though. There's a website called funwithfeet.com. <laughs> anyway, big question. Do you think the right person went home on Sunday? Oh. Tricky one. Look, it's so hard because part of competition is winning and losing. Like, and then unfortunately on the show, someone has to go home every week. And you don't want to see anyone go home. Like, I love, we love everyone on the team, don't we? It's like, so, honestly, it's such a family. Yeah. I love Becky and she's just, she's so sweet. Like, all of them, they're fantastic. At the end of the day, we're skating and we've, we've all had the same process of learning how to skate and we're just trying to become our best skaters. We've no idea what the public at home are thinking. We, we, do, we don't know. Yeah. You could like, skate and, great, and, but and, and still be going out. It, it is the result and I think it's really interesting from our background as professional athletes. It's, it's cutthroat, win or lose, you're good enough or you're not. And, and this is different because it's, it's an entertainment show and by gosh did Eki entertain everyone. No, I, I was actually disappointed with my street dance skate. Disappointed with Very it. Very disappointed it, actually. Well. Because it felt, it felt rubbery. Like to, no, it didn't, it didn't, that's wrong. It, I felt so wobbly yeah. and I felt I could have done it so much better. And it's just me and Liv against me and Liv. Like I wanted them to go out next week and just skate better than I did. Yeah. Whatever number comes up, you were board. so frustrated. I was frustrated, he man. He was frustrated. We stood waiting for our scores with the judges, and he was just, you could see that anger in him, but he was like, oh, whatever. And I looked at him and was like, did you have fun? And he said, yes. And I was like, that's all that matters. Yeah. Of course, the scores showed up well, and we did our job. And I said to him, I was like, don't judge it until you've watched it, because in this show, the feeling doesn't replicate to what you see on the ice. They're in slippery ice on these thin, fat, tiny things. But it looks so much better with than it feels. With noodle legs. With I'll tell you what legs. though, David A looked fit, didn't he? He's top off. <laughs> I was getting my makeup done and Brendan, Sylvan, and David A all walked in. They were all getting fake tan behind me. I'm getting my makeup done and that. Not my type of men, but I was like, wow. <laughs> I was distracted. And after that, I remember five minutes before they went out, they were like, Niall's too white! <laughs> makeup! <laughs> tan! I think yeah, the answer to the question, yes, the, the person went home because that's the nature of the show. Yeah. And next week, the right person will go home because they'll go home and it makes us, yeah, that's right, it's right. It could be. Because that's, the, that's what the show is. Anyway, back to the ice. This is number three of the Musketeers, like Ash has already been on. Yeah, are you, you feeling yourself as number one? I suppose you are. No, A, A, A Musketeer. I'm, I'm, I'm number one. <laughs> yeah, obviously. <laughs> Have you watched Ash's segment? Oh, oh my God! Yes! I have watched it, yeah. Yeah. He was impressive, I'm not gonna get he's impressive yeah. at everything. I know he is. Like how do you find your chances against him on ice? Skating? Um who's judging? You. And them. Them live. You look at yeah. it. Yeah. Beautiful today, by the way. What is that? Heart, so I don't know if this is sarcastic anymore. No, no. Beautiful. What is that? So you're going to give it your all. I'm going to give it my all. I'm going to try it. It's, it's, it's taking part that counts. No. Yeah. Well, no. no. Oh. Whoever said no. that is an idiot. Well, yeah. I've, I've and a loser. I've watched his <laughs> We're going to start with lemons. Lemons. Yes. Love lemons. Feet out and you're going to bend your knees, take your toes forward, finish together with your feet like this. Bend, extend. Bend, extend. Nice. Bend, bend. bend. Ext I am bending at the knees. Where else can I bend? To bend first, extend. Oh, I'm missing that part before that. Clear. I'm looking at you. Look. Look, Look forward. Look forward. You know where am I going? Okay. I think personally, lemons ticked me, Ashley. Um, yeah. Cool. We're gonna do some pushes. Niall's gonna give us a demonstration. Yep. Bring your feet back together. Bend. Push. Bring your feet back together. Bend. Push. Keep your leg bent. Yeah. Now arms in front. Arms equal. How do I point my toe? It's a fixed plastic right. boot. So we go from here to here. Oh, I see. Extended ankle, not pointed toe. So look, and my arms. <laughs> Don't know how to stop. We move on from pushes. Yeah. We'll do some shots. Yeah. Instead of having your foot scrape like this, yeah. you put like this. Oh. Feeling is you took your you took your heel under, and instead of like scraping it backwards, you push it into the floor. Yeah. 
So be equal in your hips, you're going like this. Yes, yes, no. Yes. Oh, shit. Stop! Right. See that? See that, guys? That was on the outside edge. Right. Look at that nice long skin. Ah, there you go. Wow. Look at that, guys. Tastes delicious, like success. Chee chee bang bang, we're gonna watch it. I mean, look, it was a fast routine, it was different, it was a contrast. We incorporate the car on the set. They wanted me to do gymnastics on the car. Quick story straight off the bat. I tried a bit, eventually it was gonna be pointing the audience. And I tried to roll down the front of it and just put a massive dent in the bonnet. <laughs> so I broke the car, having five minutes of seeing it. Um, so we decided to do the handstand on the back of it. Now, like the introduction, we were using it, we were flying through the air. I was so nervous to do this little bit of handstand piece. I know it sounds ridiculous because that was my job, but look where we're at. If I'd have fallen over, <laughs> I mean, sharp blades, Olivia's sat there. Um, but thankfully we didn't. Um, <clears throat> and then also stepping onto the ice, I think as, as well, it's good to know, the more and more into this process I'm, I'm getting, it's a tight turnaround and you only really get to see or practice on them at the weekend, so with Friday we perform Sunday. So like, yeah, you can run through the steps on the ice rink back in Leeds when I'm training or when you get there to, the, but like, look, you don't have a car there. Each time, every weekend, you've only got such a tight window. These little steps at the beginning, this this skill here is called a bracket. I didn't do it the best I could have done it, um, but it's quite a high level skating skill, which I was buzzing with. Um, but like, it really brought out the character. Like you can see, I'm, I've been com complimented on my acting skills. Uh, for the character that I played, such in intricate little steps. Like, look at the stuff I'm doing here. It was it was fun to learn, man. It was really fun. Each week we're stepping up the game. I have literally on every single one of these skills fallen. Now this bit I'm really embarrassed about actually, because <laughs> I'm gonna pause it right there. The lift we didn't get that much time to practice, and it was still quite a big deal for me lifting Olivia. And I've not mentioned it before. It's like lifting myself with similar weights, similar heights. Unfortunately, you see that in my face right here. So that's the only time I got out of character. I feel like I got away with it and the judges couldn't actually see my face at that point. I'm like, Ugh. And believe me, she's not heavy. It's just difficult for me to do. So that was maybe a bit of a boo-boo moment. I'm a bit embarrassed about it. I'm not playing the music for copyright reasons, but the, we're hitting every beat. And, and at this point, I'm like thinking, oh gosh, we, we're, there, we're nearly there. The stuff, if you watch the show in the BT, this next bit I did make a stumble on. And at this point, once we got around this corner, it's just the last skill, the balance car, down the tunnel, crowd pleaser, I loved it. And then I, we did actually plan to collapse in a heap on the floor, that wasn't, uh, that was, you know, the, the guys said that, the, that we should definitely do that for comedy value. And initially, there wasn't going to be a camera in the tunnel. I, I sort of loved the idea of us just disappearing. I'm really enjoying this process and it sometimes can get stressful. I've certainly been stressed this week learning the routine and, and sometimes it can feel a little overwhelming and you feel like you're a little bit unprepared. But look, the grip that, you know, Karen, Dan, who are the crowd with the team are fantastic. They make sure that we're ready. Olivia and Steve and my coach are fantastic. <laughs> Bang, 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 bang. Yeah! Yes. Stop, squat and glute. Gym life, yeah. 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 I'm gonna do it, it's right before the wall. Okay. You should learn. <laughs> yeah! Yeah? Are you gonna do it here? No, no, no. Danger, Liv. Yes! Let's go! Held my breath, but I'm quite proud. <laughs> three turns. Three turns for the cost. Do we know why it's called a three turn? Because you turn three times. No. Yeah. Yeah. I think he like this lad showed Ash his talent because like he picked these up like literally instantly. I mean, it took me days and days and days. And as you can see, it's like it's such difficult skills, but there's no way that like any of the rest of the family or the squad are gonna be able to even do a three turn. I think Luke's got it though. Come on, Luke. Oh no! I was not letting my joggers get wet. No! Just try one more of these, and then probably we'll, we'll, we'll maybe try a jump. Yeah. More hard, lift and right. right. What comes in? Yes. Good job. All right. oh. Okay. Okay. It sounds bad. I mean, it's the plastic boots. Look at my, my boots. Boot. Don't worry, my, the boots are that damaged because my hip stopped it first. I think. Yes, that's the one. That's the one. I hope. I'll give that a pass. That was really good. 
Yay! Yeah. 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 So this one you, you twist in left, but you're on your right leg. Yeah. Left hand in front. Yeah. And then you almost bend and then step onto that leg. Yeah! Push on that one. Yeah. But we understand from gymnastics, like, the design is to like live and use to make it look elegant. Yeah. And make it look simple and easy. So like we always talk about the rings. Yeah. Just holding sport on rings is really hard. Yeah, like but we make it look easy. Yeah. And it's the same with this, like they make it look elegant, but it's actually really hard. I think there's always a, a, an element of fear of falling over as well. Mm. It's very difficult to get that out of your head. And often it stops you doing the skills and makes you more likely to fall. Let's try three, Joe. Yeah. I'll just do a really small one. The left shoulder's leading. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Take off is good, but when you land. Yes. Save the bomb. Save the bomb. Big quite elegantly. Quite elegant, I'm like a cat. People often say that. <laughs> yeah. Good job. You should be really proud of what you've just learned in half an hour. Thank you. Like, I'm proud. I asked Ash this as well. Do you want to be my dancer in my spot?